Hello, welcome back to the channel for another coin hunt. Today we have a thousand pounds of two pound coins to have a hunt through. This bag was sealed on the 3rd of May and this one was sealed on the 28th of April. Let's open them up and see what we can find. And while those bags are being opened up, let's have a quick look at the book to see which designs we're still after. On page one, a couple of Commonwealth games. We need England and Northern Ireland. Northern Ireland being the rarest one in circulation. On page two, we need the Olympic handover. This one's Beijing, another very tricky one to find. And after that, we have everything up to and including the Great Fire of London. And the first find of the day is the World War I Army Centenary, so a super com common one. Uh, just worth checking the rotation on this one, also the edge inscription, it should say for King and Country which this one does, so that one is in good order and will be sent back. And here's the second commemorative of the day. This one is the DNA Double Helix. So this one is pretty common, so it gets sent back. Ah, and here we have the Trevithic. Unfortunately, this one is a very common one, although it is a nice design. And here we have Shakespeare's tragedies. So there are three Shakespeare coins in the set. This one is the mid in the middle in terms of mintage numbers. It's not a keeper. However, it is worth checking the edge description on this one. So it says, what a piece of work is a man, which is correct. There are some known ones out there which have the edge inscription from this coin and uh, it's for king and country. So that's a pretty cool error if you can find it. Yep, and here we have the first fake of the day. Very rare for us to have a two pound coin hunt without a fake, very bad one. And we have another fake. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. That is definitely a fake. More convincing than the first one. Dear, oh dear, so that's two. And here we have Marconi, not a keeper though. Quickly followed by Guy Fawkes, another one that's not a keeper, but nice to have a variety of finds. <laughs> I just checked this one on the fly because it was really super shiny and look at that absolutely brilliant rotation error let's just check where the engravers yeah yeah they're in the right spot there I was just checking where the engravers initials are absolutely brilliant look at that And here we have Charles Dickens, another very common one. Here we have Abolition of the Slave Trade. 
So this is very common, but there is an NIFC version or variant where the letters DG are just below and to the right of the seven there. So worth keeping an eye out for that. This one is the Rugby World Cup. So this is the first uh, bimetallic commemorative two pound coin that went out in circulation. Very cool. Not a keeper though. And here, this one is fake number three for the day. What's this going to be? Ah, Shakespeare's History. So this is the most common one from the Shakespeare set. So we just need the comedies now to complete the set. something let's have a look and see Charles Dickens I was hoping that might be something else it could have been a Rio handover Here we have another Jodie Clark portrait uh, 2016 at the top there so this one is going to be a Britannia there we go, so that's very nice. So that's a low tier keeper. Not a commemorative, of course. That's the definitive design that replaced technology. And here we have a low tier keeper. This one is Charles Darwin. Don't find too many of him. Very nice indeed. Here we have another Trevithic. It's the second one for the day. And here we have another DNA double helix. Shakespeare's histories. It's the second one as well. And this one is the last bag of the hunt. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> we're gonna finish with another fake. Oh dear, oh dear. Four fakes in the hunt, at least I might have missed some. Okay, I'm going to double check all the coins now, make sure I didn't miss anything the first time round, and I'll post back in a few seconds with what I find. Okay, I finished checking all the coins and I did find one more technology which is worth a closer look. Before we do, uh, let me quickly show you the Hall of Shame. This is where we put all of the fake £2 coins that we find in our hunts. Uh, so this one here, and then three more on the next page, so we've already completed the top row there. And then returning back to the commemoratives and the definitives from the hunt itself. 
Uh, pretty poor showing today from the commemoratives. I would expect to find more from a thousand pounds or two pound coins, but we did pick up a Darwin, which is a low tier keeper. We also picked up a 2016 Britannia, which is nice. And then I think the two best finds from the hunt would be these ones here. So this technology I found when I was checking the coins again. So 2015, and if I turn it around, the queen is facing that way. Uh, she should be facing this way like this. So that's a pretty cool rotation error. And then I think the best find from the hunt for me has to be this 2015. 2015 is the year when we tend to find these rotation errors. So this one is in really good nick and turn it around. The queen's completely upside down. So that's very, very cool indeed. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. If you did, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. It really makes a big difference. And I'll see you next time for another coin hunt.